Park Industries created this video as a tool to assist you in replacing your quantum drive drawbar. The first step is to remove the gripper set. Remove the anti-rotation bracket. Turn off the air pressure. Remove the water and air line. Remove the water and air line fittings. Remove the four bolts that hold the drawbar air cylinder. Remove the air lines from the drawbar air cylinder. Mark the top airline for reassembly. Remove the drawbar air cylinder. Remove the drawbar by pulling up on the water unit. Remove the water union. Install the water union on the new drawbar. Insert the new drawbar. Remount the drawbar air cylinder. Secure the drawbar air cylinder using blue Loctite on the bolts. Prior to fully tightening the four bolts, be sure the water union spins freely. If the water union doesn't spin freely, readjust the air cylinder. Tighten the four bolts that hold the drawbar air cylinder. Replace the air lines on the drawbar air cylinder. Reattach the water fitting. Reattach the air fitting. Reinsert the water and air line.
Secure the anti-rotation bracket using blue Loctite on the bolts. Turn the air back on. Insert the air cylinder gapping tool and extend the drawbar. When wiggling the gapping tool, we should feel some resistance. If there is too much or too little resistance, adjust the dial at the top of the air cylinder. Again, the goal is to have a slight amount of resistance when wiggling the gapping tool. Reinstall the gripper set. Thread the gripper set puller all the way into the gripper set. Perform the drawbar method steps on the advanced setup screen. The first step is to extend the drawbar. Second, press the capture extend button. And third, ensure the drawbar position is set to zero. Insert the ITM calibration tool. Record the drawbar position. Open the machine configuration screen. Select the drawbar setup tab. Enter the ITM drawbar position value previously recorded into the clamped position. With the ITEM tool in the machine, ensure the clamped with the tool is shown. Remove the ITM tool and ensure that clamped without a tool is shown. Insert a different tool other than the ITM tool. Again, ensure clamped with the tool is shown. As always, if you have any questions regarding your machine or these steps, please call Park Industries Customer Service at 1-800-785-3391. Park Industries hopes you found this tutorial video helpful in replacing the drawbar on your quantum drive spindle.